Over the past few years, there's been emerging data highlighting the importance of cardiovascular disease in our long-term breast cancer survivors. Did you know that if you're a long-term breast cancer survivor, you have an equal to or greater chance of dying of cardiovascular disease than breast cancer? And if you talk to your physician, what types of recommendations would they give you? Well, interestingly, many of the same recommendations we talk to our patients about for long-term breast cancer survivorship, which would include weight control, getting more exercise in, including strength training and cardiovascular exercise, and obviously making sure you're getting your checkups are all similar types of recommendations that you would get when you go to see a cardiologist. It's very important to understand what your risks are for cardiovascular disease and what risks may have been exacerbated or made worse by your breast cancer treatment. There's also a new subspecialty called cardio-oncologists, or in some cases, maybe they're called oncocardiology. This group of subspecialists are cardiologists who have some expertise in oncology as well, meaning that they understand how the treatments that you've had will impact your cardiovascular risk. It's very important to ask your physician these questions so that you can use one recipe to hopefully reduce your risk of both breast cancer recurrence and mortality from both breast cancer and cardiovascular disease. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.